Bless the name of the Lord, my friend. Indeed, we are grateful this morning for our lives that God has spared. It's a blessed, uh, amen, Tuesday morning. And truly, God has continually, amen, been good. He continues to be good, to be faithful, to be kind, compassionate. And uh, his tender mercies are always uh, with us. Praise God, amen. We are grateful, my friend, to God for another day. Amen. Today we are looking at the blessings of righteous living. Praise God. Amen. And the scripture, my friend, is coming from Proverbs chapter 21 and verse 21. And it reads thus, He that followeth after righteousness and mercy findeth life. Praise God. Righteousness and honor again he that followeth after righteousness and mercy findeth life righteousness and honor amen so these things my friend we will find when we follow after righteousness he said life we will find life praise god righteousness and honor amen so life which is pointing to eternal life not a temporary thing that we are in right now because this life amen it shall come to an end but eternal life amen which we shall receive amen at the coming back of our savior that my friend is of significant importance and he said that when we live a righteous life we will find life righteousness and honor amen praise god you you, my friend will receive honor when you start to live righteous praise God people will look at you amen and respect you because of your principles that you live up to because you followed the scripture amen and you follow the examples written in the word of God amen and you live a righteous life that is why amen it's entitled the blessings of righteous living you will be blessed when you live a righteous life praise god amen and it's also a journey of faith which means that if you don't have faith in god you cannot live a righteous life because it takes faith my friend in the true and living god it takes faith in the things that are written in the word amen to continue amen on the street and narrow path to continue to walk uprightly before god it takes faith and faith faith and trust are the same so you have to trust in god amen so that you amen can walk in the blessings of god and live a life that is righteous and praise god it also means to embrace god's ways whatsoever ways please god those are the ways that we are going to embrace amen to embrace something means to hold firm to that thing amen praise God not looking to the right hand or to the left it is that thing that you put your trust in your faith in amen embracing God's ways not the ways of this world amen not the ways of Baal not the ways of Selassie not the ways of your prime minister not the ways amen of your culture but the ways of God amen that my friend represent righteousness and all also walking in wisdom so when you live a righteous life you are walking in wisdom it takes wisdom my friend amen to live righteously and we get the wisdom from the written word of God praise God even as we have read the scripture praise God that the man that is righteous will receive life which represents eternal life righteousness and honor people will respect you praise God when you walk in wisdom praise God the other thing is the key to true fulfillment so righteousness is the key to true fulfillment so if you want your life to be fulfilled amen if you want to live a fulfilled life praise God you better live a righteous life because that my friend amen is of significant importance righteousness exalts a nation but sin is a 
reproach unto any people. Praise God. Amen. And the final one we want to look at is the living a life of purpose. When we live a righteous life, amen, we are living a life of purpose. Because remember, amen, your life has purpose. That is why God created you. He created you, formed you in the womb of your mother for a reason, a purpose. Amen. Praise God. And that purpose, my friend, must be fulfilled. And in living a righteous life, you will find that purpose. Praise God. Dear God and our Father, we exalt you, we lift you up, we magnify you, we thank you. Amen. Even for this word, this uh, amen devotion. Praise God. This scripture. Amen. Pointing us to righteous living, knowing that when we live a righteous life, amen, we will fulfill the purpose for which you called us. For you did not create us, God, amen, to fulfill a sinful life, to live a lifestyle of sin, but to live a lifestyle of righteousness, faith in God, trusting you wholeheartedly, amen, so that you can get the glory out of our lives. Cover us under your blood and help us to walk in wisdom, walk in the straight and narrow path and stay in righteousness, O oh God Almighty, so that you can get the glory out of our lives. For these and for other mercies we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. And if you believe it, type in the box, Lord, please help me to embrace your will by living a righteous life. Amen. Like, share. Amen. And follow for more. Praise God. Tomorrow, same time, same place. Another day's devotion. Be blessed.